Hello, welcome back to episode 4 of the series, Gunfight at the Sawmill. Um, yeah, when we left off I killed an old man because he was shooting a Gatlin gun at me. You can duck to better hide and avoid, yep, I didn't know that. Okay, oh, hello. A few weeks after that right. dust up at the OK Corral, I was still after Johnny Ringo. Seven months. I had tracked him and the cowboys to their hideout at a sawmill, and they were loaded for bear. AZ is Arizona, right? I think that's it. Okay, here we go. Um, nope. So, what exactly did Johnny Ringo do to piss you off? Well, yeah. Well, him and that other bastard. Roscoe Bob Bright? Yep. They both deserve to die, and I promise I'll tell you why. Okay. But first, I need to tell you about the cowboy's new boss, Curly Bill Brocious. Herb's coming! Get ready, yeah. boys. Oh, hello. God damn, he's yeah. hard to hit! Am I really? Crouch behind this rock. Yes, that's much better. Had enough? You're dead. Curly Bill dead. took charge of the cowboys upon the old man's demise, and after that gunfight at the OK Corral. The Clantons wanted revenge. Oh, he's hurt now. All right. Let's get some upgrades going. What about this? Longer combos. Roll the ammo capacity increase. Let's go longer combos. All right. This is getting better. All right. Let's see here. What do we got going? Kill that stupid son of a bitch! Oh shit! Stand still. There. there you go. So they murdered Morgan Earp and grievously wounded his older brother Virgil. Oh, for fuck's sake! Anyone except the one closest to me. Wyatt and Doc went on what became known as the Vendetta Ride, hunting those outlaws down. Oh, okay. So when I showed up, that's who they thought I was. Intense. I'm sorry that I'm not talking as much as I should be. I got a with your name on it, boy. That's nice. Can I get it? Where are you? Can I have it? Can I have it? Can Come I... out, you yellow bastard! I'm white. <clears throat> Die for 
front. I guess I got the bullet. Okay. What are you doing? Jump. There we go. Rifle ammo. Exactly what I need. Which way? What? Oh. Got checkpoint. Awesome. That looks like it's gonna be fun. Hello, hello, hello. Hello. Yep. There were killers around every corner, all wearing red bandanas. That's how the cowboys identified each other. And I was beginning to wish I had one myself. Well, that's a good idea. You can't hide forever! But I wasn't about to let Ringo walk away unscathed. And that's what drove me forward. They say that Ringo was infernally fast. I hardly saw anyone faster, boy. Certainly not Wyatt Earp. That man was all hat and no cap. Okay, shit, son. Oh, there's a shotgun. There's a shotgun. We got a shotgun. Put some holes in it. Uh, uh, Herb wasn't much of a match for him, but Doc Holiday might have taken him. <laughs> that longer should have kept his nose out of it. They never charged anyone for the murder of Morgan Herb. Everybody knew that Curly shot him in the back. That was yeah. common knowledge. Yeah, maybe so. But Ringo had nothing to do with it. He was just being loyal to a friend. Mm. Is that what you call it? Being loyal. Well, to get to that loyal friend, I had to pass by some buzz saws as big as a man. Where are the buzz saws? This is gonna hurt. Excuse me, sir. I have a question. Yes. What's that, Dwight? After old man Clanton died. Why didn't his son take over the Cowboys? Because I Clanton was dumber than a box of rocks and a yellow belly to boot. Taking down the entire cowboy gang single-handed. Indeed I was, Jack. <laughs> there were 
It wasn't easy as those boys had good cover. And then This one. Get him from the side. <laughs> there he is. I blink. me then, Jesus. How about you have this? Look out! There were carts everywhere, piles of lumber, and God knows what else for people to hide behind. That really was one hell of a sawmill. Quite an impressive operation. Yep, we're going this way. 
And where was Curly Bill? Did you see him? No, not yet. I'm about to get to that, Ben. Patience. I'm painting a picture here. There was this beautiful waterfall and a crystal clear stream that led to a verdant valley that was truly... Consider your picture painted. What happened next? Well, finally the bastards that were still alive made a last stand. Curly Bill, Johnny Ringo, and his compadres took off into the lumber yard, and I followed after. Oh god, here we go. Takes a shot before he takes a shot. I get you. Are you saying they ran? Cowardice was not in Ringo nor Curly Bill's nature. No, sir. I never said they were running scared. They just wanted me out in the open. Time to dance with the devil! Let's see what you got. You work in the wired earth. Get that son of a bitch. Show him to make dance. Uh, no. 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 He was almost dead. Fuck you. Fucking. <laughs> I pressed the wrong button. <laughs> yes. Headshot runner gave me no it. choice but to take <sighs> his life. But Ringo yes. was nowhere to be found. Oh no. I knew you didn't kill Ringo, because he was found dead in a different location altogether. To this day, his killer is still unknown. Indeed. Took me a few months before I finally tracked his ass to West Turkey Creek Canyon. Hmm. <laughs> Next in line to take over and take a bullet, Johnny Ringo. Oh wow. That's incredible, sir. I always thought that Doc Holliday was the one that killed him. Fuck my mouse. In the throat. 
Sorry I had to ruin the legend for you, boy. But the legend ain't always true. Da -da -doom. I got him. Doc Holliday had nothing to do with the death of Johnny Ringo. Anyway, thank you for watching. This has been part four. And I hope you're enjoying the series so far. Please leave a like. And, um, yeah, subscribe if you haven't. And I hope to see you in the next episode. Bye for now.